Hello guys, good morning! And it's Miss Kafla Girl as usual and uh, I'm having my green tea in one hand and another hand I have um, cereal by Nesquik. This is my favorite so far and I'm really addicted to that after I flew to St. Petersburg. And you will ask me why I don't have any makeup and that's because I decided to do a very nice tutorial for you that you're asking for such a long time and this is a makeup tutorial for the Emirates flight. So two of my favorite products uh, to apply even before I start the foundation are Shuimura products and the brushes. So the one brush is number 18, made of gold, the gold bristles are by Shuimura. And another one is a brush by Estee Lauder that I found in the kit when I bought it in the airport. So and the products I love is the BB Perfector and um, Shuimura Instant Glow. So Instant Glow is kind of a strobe cream by MAC, but I prefer this one because I really love the texture, I really love it. I do not apply these products on this part of the forehead, so because uh, for me, I think this is the most um, the part that becomes um, shiny, like a mirror. So I prefer to skip it and apply it just on my face, but not on the forehead. So let's start. Hand. And I'm just gonna put my hair a little bit up for you to see just like that and first I'm gonna use a still other brush you guys you should see how I attached the mirror uh, the uh, phone right now because I do not have any mirror next to me it's it's like a window and uh, it was so funny uh, I was thinking how to do it how so I just took the tape you know the double-sided tape and I just attached it so it's uh, how it is holding it's like a secret only yeah it's very 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 strange so I applied the strobe, uh, the um, instant glow cream and uh, with the brush. Now I'm going for another brush and I'm taking my BB cream. Exactly the same. It's okay if it will get mixed up. It's absolutely fine. I love the shade. For me, that is really beautiful. And this brush, for me, it makes wonders, even uh, um, especially for the foundation. I love, I love, I love it so much. Now I'm using a little bit of concealer, if that is NARS, um, light to vanilla. So I just apply it a little bit, just like that. I don't know if you can see because it's very bright. And now guys, I'm using this huge brush. You can find it in any makeup brand, but this one is by... Um, it's number 30. It's actually from the uh, clinic that um, I was studying makeup in London. It's from the London Aesthetic. And I'm using Terracotta, uh, blush, well, that is like a blush, a highlighter. It, um, I don't like contouring. I don't do it for my fair skin. I hate it. So this one is just Terracotta. It looks like that and um, four seasons. So I just take generously like that. And now I'm using uh, to, uh, just to moisturize my lips with my favorite uh, Lucas Popo ointment, a little bit. And then I'm gonna apply brush straight away. Done. So the blush you already saw, I guess, that is Catrice. German brand, as far as I know, uh, 070. And the angled brush that looks like that as well, from London Aesthetic Clinic. So I just take a little bit and um, And for the brows, I always use Anastasia Beverly Hills a Tinted Brow Gel and this one is uh, called, called Caramel. I used to do before um, Shui Mura um, pencil for the eyes, but now I stopped as well. So this is very easy, it's multi-purpose, it's just like super easy to use. You can see all I'm doing, I'm just brushing my brows and you can see difference, right? Yeah, so that's how I do it all days any flight so now you know guys I don't know if guys can do it actually or not yeah this is super convenient to use and actually very fun to play with all right so now it's time for the eye makeup and I always use my Marc Jacobs palette that is called 204 the starlet and uh, the colors are I will 
will show you. The colors are just like that. And the brush I'm using is MAC 224. Nice brush. So the colors I'm taking, I'm gonna show you just like that. One moment, one moment, okay. So I'm taking, I'm mixing this one with this tree. And I'm just applying on, uh, just like that. Okay. And another one. Oh guys, this feels really so nice. I'm sure you missed this part. So this is done. So for the next step is the eyeliner. So that's another question you always ask me, how do I do my eyeliner? So these are three eyeliners that I always use for different parts of the line itself. So let's start with the basic one. The basic one is uh, uh, by L'Oreal Paris. L'Oreal Paris. So then on top of it, I'm going with the gouache 02 gray. And on, in the corner, I do it with the um, Rimmel Glam Eyes. Rimmel Glam Eyes. Alright, so let's start the, the um, line. I'm going to do it in the mirror of uh, Guerlain. So I just do the outer corner very gently. Let's say I'm just doing the line. So I do one line like that. And then I start with the inner corner. Just making it a bigger line, let's say a more thick. And I just continue it all the way, getting to the roots of the lashes. And if I do it without a video like that, it takes me like a couple of minutes. It's very quick, it's like super, super quick. Let's do it, let's do it. You can see that is really so quick, especially if you do it every day. Okay, so the first step is done. So step number two. I'm taking another eyeliner by Gosh, and I'm making it on top because it has a nice gray color and I want to mix both of them together. So that liner looks also like that. It's like very, very tiny. So I'm doing a line as well, but straight away I'm combining it together. Like I'm doing this nice, nice, nice flick, just like that. And then I start again from the inner corner. And I close my eyes to make it a nice smooth line. And breaking on the roots of the lashes. Yeah, perfect. So you see difference, right? So let's start another one. Okay, the eyeliner is ready, and one more little trick I always use, I take one more eyeliner that is even more precise than this one. That one is like super precise, and I'm working only on my outer corners to make it very nice and very, very plain, playful. So this eyeliner, you have to play with that like that little bit before you use it every time. So let me show you how that looks like. Check this brush. Can you see the difference? That is just so tiny. And I'm working only on the outer corner. Voila! So now that's exactly what I need. And let's do another side. Alright, all done. So now for the lower lashes, I do not put any mascara. I can't remember a day, guys, when I really put a mascara because I think when you fly a lot and when you remove makeup, it really harms your eyes because you have mascara and you always, you know, try to smudge it when you remove it every day. So I decided to skip the step and take care of my lashes. I usually put some nice gel, you know, to take care of them. 
And now I'm going to show you what I'm doing with my lower lashes. It's a little secret and that's it. So what I'm doing with my lashes is I'm taking my eyeshadows, the one that you already saw before, and I'm taking MAC brush 266. So that is actually the brow brush, but I... <laughs> all with the line. Can you see on my little finger? But it's okay. It's makeup. It's art. So I use this one and um, I take another color, just like this, and I just apply my lower line just like that and then I take a q-tip and smudge everything I remember one of the guys was asking why when you do makeup like all girls he meant you always uh, open your mouth <laughs> I don't know but it's true so that is what I did and one more little. Yes, I'm just taking a Q-tip and uh, smudging just like that on my both eyes. That is kind of a la smoky eyes for the evening, but I do it for my flights. So then I'm taking um, another product from Korea for the highlighting. In is free. The brush I cannot really see. It's called Mark Two. I think it's two three three. So I'm taking this highlighter just like that. Any color. It's all gonna be nice white. And I'm just applying it on the inner corner. So let's do another eye like that as well. And then I put a little bit on the bridge of the nose, under the brow, and just here so you can see I really love highlighter so much perfect ready and then I have lips left so for the lips I have a Kiko invisible lip liner looks like that that's the pencil with a transparent whitish thingy so I just do the contour of course it's going to be transparent but for you guys to understand if guys are watching me not girls so that's what keeps your lipstick in place not all over your face and because I don't have red lipstick with me at the moment, uh, it's uh, in the bag, in another room. So I'm going to show you the one I use for everyday use, uh, the Rivlon Spintage. But I'm going to just use it um, to show you how I do my lipstick. I don't apply any brush br brushes. I'm doing it very easy. So basically the makeup is ready. And everything is ready for me, putting my hat on, making my hair up, and just getting ready for the flight. So I hope you enjoyed the video, guys. And that is very easy to make, really easy, but because you're asking me so many times, I might do another tutorial for you very soon and show you different products because I always check different stuff. But for now, you have the idea how I do it for my eyeliner because that was the most, most, most uh, lifetime you know, saving advice and tip how I do it. So now you can see, I hope you really enjoyed it. Please subscribe as usual for the Skyfly Girl. And uh, I will make another video for you very soon. Today I'm still on vacation and I have plans very nice to go somewhere and see something. I will not tell you now, it's a secret. I'm gonna finish my tea straight away to have my Nesquik and I'm gonna go see my sister again. So thank you so much for watching me and being with me and have a super nice day, guys. And пока-пока! Bye!